Hello YouTube and welcome to the desert. Uh, today in the SE Lab Guides we'll bring you to Laguna Seca in the Lamborghini Huracan Evo 2. My name is Sir Fosh and for speed exit we're breaking just before the wi last white line on the right there. You definitely don't want to be one of those people who exits the pits right in the middle of turn one. I've seen that happen quite a few times so that is something to keep in mind and also worth uh, doing quite a uh, few practice runs for the pit entry and exit in this case. But yeah, Laguna Seca, one of the more popular circuits in all of sim racing and racing uh, video game genre in general. Uh, definitely quite an iconic circuit, uh, but in, in its core it's actually quite a simple simple circuit there is the corkscrew that we're approaching that is definitely very very unique as a corner but the rest of the circuit not so unique not really uh so challenging let's say still extracting the best pace out of this uh track is uh, very difficult like everywhere else but uh the circuit itself is not that complicated let's put it this way Apart from the last corner lacking any kind of braking reference, uh, but we'll talk about that on this lap. Uh, so obviously we shorten the line for the run to turn one, and the braking for turn one to combo is just after the foreboard. Uh, downshifting to first, and we're short shifting to second gear for the exit. Uh, for this corner we're breaking after the two board try to hit the apex a little more than that uh, Here we're breaking quite a bit before the curb ends uh, Definitely want to hit the inside curb and not run into the gravel there, especially with your rear wheels uh, Breaking just when the rubber marks start for this corner uh, That's another thing the gravel or the sand on the off tracks really dangerous here for this corner we're breaking at the two mark and keeping a little bit of throttle in to prevent the car from snapping uh because those inside sausages are deadly uh for corkscrew breaking once again just at the rubber mark uh try to not cut the inside line too much this is just a lift corner or maybe a little bit of brakes if you're going into hot and here we're breaking when the red curb starts on the outside or the left and for this corner like i said before there isn't really a good reference it's a really uh tricky corner to get right and i still mess it up all the time but it's mostly down to experience to get that one uh nailed so so yeah. this is our setup uh a little bit of positive toe uh, and uh, mechanical grip wise running quite a lot stiffer car once again uh on front and back and also the roll bars. The dampers are pretty standard for me uh, in the Lambo. And arrow-wise running quite a bit of rake. Uh, maybe for the race one click less a rake would do good as the setup is quite aggressive, uh, but uh, seems pretty fast. There's definitely more lap time in it than uh, I managed to extract on my hot lap, but uh, overall feels pretty good to drive. I haven't really done a lot of race running here, so would approach with caution and definitely do some practice beforehand to see if it works all right for you. That being said, I'll leave you off with a hot lap and see you on the next one.